with you here, streaming live. Um, that's what we're doing. We're we're trying. We're learning. We're trying to learn. Okay. So um, so I guess I was talking to to the thin air, right? <laughs> so hi there. Hi, how you guys doing? Greg McLeod here from ETU, Elite Traders University, and uh, so glad to be able to broadcast to you live via live stream. Um, and um, why well, I don't think I, I got long the, if you're following me in the our private Facebook group, um, we got long um, the euro, the euro versus uh, USD. You can see we've got the trend indicator and it looks pretty strong there. But we got short and we took the short was really a good uh, trade for us. And that was during uh, our mentorship class. Monday is usually our mentorship class and we got short. And, uh, you know, we took it all the way down, um, down here, right? Pretty good move. Um, yeah, so 17 pips. And we were able to forecast that price was going to do this. You know, under a bunch of red candles. This is a five minute chart of the euro. And we took it short. Price rallied up a little bit. Didn't come back against the um, the old swing high, a swing high about the one spot, one, nine, two, two. And basically we have three wave correction down, down to a, to a demand zone. Demand zone came in from the uh, April 12th uh, yesterday. You know, we had a penetration of that zone and a push back up above it, congestion. This is like your, your fishing expedition, your, um, what do you call it, the, the bear trap. Nice bear trap, turn, and then price rallied up. And uh, then we, we had you know, higher highs, higher lows. Well, we had a break of a rising trend line. We broke the trend line and then price just collapsed and we were able to, to take advantage of that, that reversal of trend, right? Um, then we got long again and we took, the price all the way back up to the pivot. This is a central pivot. Pivot points are commercial support and resistance. And uh, these uh, areas uh, basically uh, tell us where there's commercial demand support, supply and demand. But also uh, like the central pivot, it basically takes the, the, the average price or the typical price. It's the they take the yesterday's uh, high, low, and close and divide by three to come up with this central pivot line. So this is the average price of the euro, the average rate that was trading around the one spot, one, nine, zero, zero area. That's like that, the typical, the, the average price. And that formed this resistance line for the next day, okay? So at 5 p.m. Eastern time, Right, 5 p.m. is when the new pivots come out because the banks close and you have this, you know, the swap and all that stuff going off the banks. And then so these new pivots are drawn. And so you can see how price rallied from a demand zone, breaking a trend line. And the broken trend line allowed price to rally up right at the pivot. So this line was drawn at 5 p.m. and now it's 2 a.m. and this held, we yeah, have a confluence of resistance here. Um, I was actually looking for a break maybe up into to the, the one spot 1908 and maybe even as high as one spot 1920. So I got a little greedy there, you know, like, you know, got some positions off but left some on. And then price came back and did a full, not just a 100% retracement, but like 110% retracement. Very quick. I was, in fact, I was you know, turning on the camera and said, hey, guys, if these guys miss this entry, then, then I posted this in the Facebook group. I, I posted it for you guys to see it. And um, so I, I posted it and I posted it in, the, um, in my chat as well, in my uh, private chat for our for our mentorship clients and we took this down together and then i posted this and then i mean we were just you know pretty good um profit just from the from the get get go with little 
little uh, flashback, you know, about 12.9 pips in a matter of an hour. So that's not bad. In fact, I, I was kind of asleep with it when I saw this. I was actually, uh, you know, a little bit sleepy, got a little hungry, had some grilled steak in the refrigerator. I figured, let me slice off a couple of pieces, walk by my, you know, my computer was on the table, it was flashing and doing its thing. I'm like, okay, what's it chiming? You heard chiming maybe a couple of minutes ago. And then I, you know, before I went to the refrigerator, I, let me just check to see what this is doing. I'm like going, hey, this looks like a really good setup. So I said, let me go ahead and send out a message to my to my mentorship group, you know, and I'll show you. You know, like, oh, maybe he's full, Greg's full of shit. You know, he's always making stuff up. It's like, no, I'm not, I'm not, you know? And then, um, okay, where was it? Okay, yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. so I said, Euro breakout, right? And this is an Eastern time, I'm in Central. Nice follow-up, Greg, from Jeff. And um, so I went ahead and posted it into our scalpers and alumni, say, hey, you guys, say, hey, look, this thing is gonna break out, blah, 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 you know? So, you know. So they, uh, so there you go. So I'm this guy. I said, let me get back online. I said, you know, I'm like, I said, you know, the guy. I I haven't live streamed in a long time because the software has changed and upgraded, and you know, I don't keep up with the upgrades. So I thought, let me go ahead and do this. Let me go ahead and say, look, guys, <laughs> this is a second chance to get. So this is what I did. I go, okay, we already ran up to here, and guys missed it. Let me go ahead and just put some fibs on. And let me just go ahead and say, okay, look for one of these fib areas to hold and we'll get long. Really? It's like green eggs and ham, Sam, I am. Hey, Euro, do you like 23.6? No, I don't like 23.6. I like green eggs and ham, Sam, I am. How about 38.2? Well, I don't like 38.2. So I just broke down. How about 50% retracement? No, I don't like the 50% retracement. I'll go, how about do you like the 618? Everyone likes the 618. No, I don't like 618 with green eggs and ham, Sam, I am. Okay, how about the 786? No, I don't like the 786, <laughs> Greg. How about, okay, I said, how about the 88.6? It's like 88.6, I don't like 88.6, you know, you know, green eggs and ham, so I am. How about the 100% expansion retracement? No, I don't like the 100%. I go, what the, what do you like? Come on now. Then it went to the 110% retracement. Well, you know, the market makers know these fib levels, and they know that the Elliott Wave people are gonna look, hey, this is an old wave seed, low, low ending diagonal. So they intentionally push price down, stop everybody out, right? Except for me, I, I, I just pulled my stop back. I did something like normally, I tell my students, don't ever do, don't walk your stop back. But I figure I have an S1 pivot, which is usually a pretty good level you'll find the S1 pivot tested during the London session, which is now it's London, you know, London open. Okay. And so London session, lots of liquidity comes in to the market. It's almost like the opening bell for the Forex market. Okay. The Forex market technically trades 24 seven, you know, five and a half days a week and it never closes, but really there is, you know, if you trade Asia session, it's kind of dull. And so, when you get that surge of volume that comes in during the London session, well, that's like an open, right? I mean, like ding, 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 and the feeding bell comes in and everyone takes off. Look at those, these big, these big bullish candles here. We're breaking trend line support and, um, you know, uh, resistance, we're breaking resistance. We're bouncing off of the, bounced off of the, the one spot 1883. And um, so, so they fished out all the double bottom people. Hey, this is gonna be a double bottom. All those people got jacked, right? And the um, pivot point people, they're still in it. And the, no, we got a trend line break. So um, if you're just watching this program right now, uh, well, you're lucky because this is the probably the beginning of a larger move. And see if there's a chat box and see if there's anyone online with me. I'll type something. Hello. Hello. I think what is actually happening is my, uh, it, you probably are on Facebook and I'm probably broadcasting live on Facebook, of course, right? But I'm 
broadcasting from my laptop with one screen and not from the office, which has the multiple screens because I'm in my pajamas and it's cold in the office. So um, I can't see anything that you're typing, but I could switch screens and see if you are there. And, um, but you'll see everything there, okay. I don't know, am I, where am I, am I broadcasting somewhere? And I'm looking here, maybe, I'm trying to see, if, oh, I'm live, I'm live, look, look, I'm live, oh, look, dude, hey, hi there, I can see myself, wow, okay, anyone else there? Any comments? Let me type in the comments. Hello. I'm live. Well, this is pretty cool. I can actually, I can trade from the, I can't really trade, but I can see the screen and I can see somebody there. Okay, so I'm broadcasting and it's lonely. Is what I say. Well, Greg, we haven't broadcasted in almost like a year and a half. And so it's going to take some time to build your audience. <laughs> okay. No worries. No worries. But this is pretty cool, you know? I mean, I can, I, I'm on my Facebook and, uh, and I'm looking for anybody, anybody out there. Nobody out there. Okay. I'm live. Oh boy, he's live too. Ooh. Anyway. So anyway, uh, this will probably be a really good recording. If you are watching this and um, if no one else is watching, I can say there's actually thousands of people watching you right now, but they're not. And that's okay. Because remember, 90% of people lose and 10% win. Because 10% of the people are at the right places and the other 90% are at the wrong places. You know. Um, but um, another great trader is Michael Jacobson, awesome trader, Svetlana Belmont. I can't pronounce her last name, but I can pronounce her first name, but she's awesome. And big shout out to my, they're my trading team. They are my instructors on my course. And we have break the trend line right there. Oh, very cool. Anybody in this? I'm live, people. I'm live, I'm live. I just wonder if I take this link and if I post it in here. Let's see if I can do something, okay. Let's see if I can drum up some business. You know, follow me, I'm sharing my screen. And you're gonna follow me to my private room. Okay, create a post. I am live trading here. Okay. Let me get back there. Okay, so we got a break. Look at that. Nice break. Test of the, the, the zone here. And um, you know, type your type your chats. This screen, I guess. I oh three people. Hey, I see eyeballs. Say hi or something. Type in the chat underneath the screen and let me know you're out there. Hey, people. Hey, hey. I'm so excited. I've been off the air for so long. Why buy and hold when you can pip and run? Hey, hey. Winner, 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 chicken there. Oh, no. Oh, my internet is starting to, to go haywire. Let me go back. Come on now. Hey, Hugh, he's there. Oh, my computer is going nut, nuts, nuts, nuts. Okay, we get back in here, find the trading platform. Okay, I don't see any comments, so I'm going to go over here and just hang out. Okay. So okay, so that um, so we're up on our trade. We're, we're making money right now, and you're watching it if you're here. Um, oh, I know. I can use my phone. Yeah, that's that's a good idea, Greg. That <laughs> I, I'm I'm learning this te new technology. 
Yeah, I'll play some nice music in the background. I got this like really cool music thing. Let me see. Let me see. Okay, I can do this. I can do this. Okay. I don't know what that is. Alarms barking. They're all going at me. All right, let's do this again. Go here. Ooh, uh, go oh uh, here. No, no, here. No. Go here. Okay, I'm gonna go here. And I think it's called right. Oh, okay. There we go. How's that? I don't know if you can hear me or not. Can you then? Okay. There we go. Little little music, money music. Okay. And I'm gonna see if I can find my Facebook thingy. So again, we're long the Euro five minute chart. We got long from the man zone, one spot, one, eight, eight, eight. And we're looking for price to move a bit higher. Got a little bit of a scare there as price penetrated the uh, the low down here at uh, one spot, one, eight, eight, five, four. Hopefully we can uh, break out to some new highs and walk away with some with some cash. Right? So good to be with you guys and wishing you all the best when you're trading. Remember to visit us at www.elitetradersuniversity.com. We got a free ebook. Also, we've got um, a free masterclass as well. And um, I look forward to being able, able to help you in your trading. My internet is starting to go haywire. Okay, so what I'm doing now is um, I can see your chats. If you chat underneath the, the video box, I can actually um, respond to you. Now, there's a really bad lag. I mean, this thing is uh, totally behind. Uh, I'm currently seeing price at one spot, uh, 1895 live. And I'm looking here. And um, so, I'm trying to zoom in. Yeah. yeah. One spot, one, eight, nine, five. This music might be a little loud. I'm not sure if you can even hear it. Well, again, my name is Greg McLeod with the Elite Traders University, and so glad to be with you. It is 3.21 a.m. Eastern Time, broadcasting to you live from Dallas, Texas, EliteTradersUniversity.com. I'm, I'm the CEO and founder, and we help traders make more money, more profit without buying and holding using Forex, high frequency Forex scalping. That's what we do. One spot, 1895 on the euro. Our trend indicator is going green. 
And we have liftoff, ladies and gentlemen, at the 382, making some progress to the north side. And we're making some progress. We're, we're looking for that whole number, round number resistance, one spot, one nine zero zero to come into play, come into focus. And that's that zone there. In fact, we have an indicator called the round number indicator. Because uh, uh, we find that uh, price lines hanging around round numbers quarter lines, we call them, 25, 50, 75. So, we, so these lines are broken out into 25 pip increments. So there we go. So we're, we're breaking to a new high. Let's go ahead and zoom in. And you can see we've re totally retraced this bearish move. Uh, the bears took control for a short time, or it seems like this was more of a fishing market manipulation in event, with this big red candle here. But then we've got this harami pattern. Harami means skin on the belly, where you have like a pregnant mama and the baby on the front. So it's called a, a harami, right? This reversal candlestick pattern gave us an indication that price is gonna go higher. We got long and we're gonna be limiting out of a couple of positions at the 200 simple moving average. That's the red line on my screen. The 200 simple moving average is one of the most widely watched indicators in all of technical analysis. It usually demarcates bulls from the bears. It's, it's like the, the scrum line or the, like a kind of a, like the line of scrimmage in football. One spot, one, eight, nine, six. We're gonna look for a break, that whole number round number area right here. Let's see, we have our round number indicator up here too. And we have a nice bit of space here. So almost like a, a gap where prices dropped. I mean, we have one position that's up 5.6 pips, 5.8 pips. And we have another one that's up, another one that's up uh, about 8.3 pips. And this is a return of pip and run. So it's one of my, uh, it was a streaming uh, broadcast I used to do many years ago. And uh, we're back. We're using the same strategy that we've used for over basically 20 years. <laughs> you know, a lot of people say, well, certain strategies will stop working after a certain amount of time. And it's like, eh, yeah. This one has worked for a really, really long time. In fact, we have a take profit there for about uh, our 10 pip target is the old high. We got basically a V bottom, which reversal pattern. And again, that this uh, for you, you, those of you who are just joining in, we had price come back down to this um, to the zone of um, this demand zone, right? Demand zone was. Uh, and you can see that it's been fishing around this zone for a while where price just mm, pushed through, stopped people out, took it up, right? So it fishes through that zone. And then now we've fished it one more time and looks like, um, but with less force, 
And you can see that there's a rising trend line here. As demand steps in, each push down, the bears have basically are starting to lose or losing, or they're losing power. And if they're losing power, well then we have a, so there we go. Higher lows. We did have some lower highs. And now we're moving, moving on up, moving on up like George and Wheezy, moving on up. Hope you guys are having a good day or morning. If you're in Europe, good morning to you. Uh, it's a new day. Still night or dark outside. It's early morning though, the wee hours of the morning here in the US. And I'm so glad that you could join me and be with me today as I demonstrate Pip and Run. Pip and Run is my proprietary system, uh, which I've uh, used for, you know, close to 20 years. More like, say, it's like, more like 17, 18 years, actually. I was, uh, I worked, I was the currency analyst and uh, trade instructor for one of the world's largest Forex broker dealers in the world, Forex Capital Markets, or FXCM. And any of you guys old-time Forex people probably remember me, you know, the hip star, why buy and hold when you can pip and run. And uh, again, we are we are coming here uh one spot one eight nine eight. We are approaching the one spot one nine zero zero whole number round number resistance with a 200 simple moving average there. That, that's our red line. We're also coming across a central pivot that which is the white line, and also a hundred percent retracement of the down move that we had. And so now we see that uh many of the people who were short are on the wrong side of this trade. And now they have to buy their positions back. So this is what we call a classic short squeeze rally, a short squeeze rally in the, in the process. And we're about to take profit on our trade. And um, remember, I took this short. And not only did I take it short earlier with my mentorship group, but I also came in and I turned around and got long. And I told you guys about it. If you guys are in my room, you saw me you know, you know, indicate that. And I actually posted in the Facebook group. If you're not part of my, my free Facebook group, uh, make sure you, you know, send me a request. Or There we go. Winner, winner, chicken dinner, baby. <laughs> I still got it, right? Still got it. Did it, uh, oh, there you go, right? So we got out of those trades for 100 pips each. I mean, not 100 pips, uh, 100K a lot. Uh, so, and so now we're, so we've got these two, these heavier lots here. There's a 11,000 right there. I'm gonna go ahead and close one of these out. I'm gonna close with this one out here. So and that's the one we got in from, look, at we, the razor focus of the getting out, <laughs> stepping into it, again, another fishing expedition by the bears trying to, or the, you know, trying to force people out. But we ran into a, a supply, a demand zone. A demand zone, we broke a supply trend line and got a nice move up. And now we're at new highs. We have broken through, guys. One spot, one nine zero one. We are at new highs, okay? We have broken out and look, we're here in the airspace, that air gap of, uh, and now we're at one spot, one nine zero one and climbing guys. This is pip and run. This is the way it comes. This is the way we do it. This is how we play the game, right? Um, and we do this all the time, every day. And so my question to you is, 
why aren't you, why haven't you joined? Why haven't you gone to www.leadtradersuniversity.com forward slash apply and learn the skills that pay the bills? I've been doing this for a really long time, almost 25 years. And I've been teaching people all around the world, people who become financially free, be able to buy the house of their dreams, be able to travel around the world. All that stuff that you hear, well, guess what? It's true. And you just saw it right here in a live broadcast, a live stream where I got long. You didn't see me get short. That's what, That was my for my private. My private students saw me short this and they were in, in the room. Hey, Ken, Ken's in the room. Whoop, whoop. What's up, Ken? Or cut from Michigan. <laughs> Damn, look, did you see that euro go up, baby? Break out above the old high. Woohoo! There you go. What do you think about that? And give me a thumbs up or a heart or something. Let me know what did you like that you see. You're in the room, right? I mean, you're one of the, you are part of the Pippin Run alumni. And so did you see me post this in, in the private room? Did you see me place that trade? Can you, can you tap a little bit for us? A lot of people, they say, oh, you Greg's a scam. He's not real. He does, uh, he does Photoshop, you know. I'm going to give him a fake phone number and a fake email address because I don't, for my privacy. I go, privacy? You want privacy and you want to learn how to make like thousands of hundreds of thousands of dollars? <laughs> and you get, I can't, I just, I, can't, I couldn't believe it. You know, Michael told me, well, someone does, people give fake email addresses because for privacy. I'm like, going, I'm teaching you how, I'm handing out free money, <laughs> showing you how to make money. <laughs> and you give me a fake email address. You know, it's hilarious. It's hilarious. It's completely hilarious. But uh, thank you. All right. My first thumbs up of 2000. And well, I mean, I haven't been online streaming. I've been recording and stuff, but I've been, it's been private. It hasn't been public like this. Um, it's not going to take you forever. I mean, look, I've been on, I've been on the air for like, what? 15 minutes. I'm already in. You want to see how much this one is? You want to see how much this one is? 15,986. And we're hitting it. We're hitting the air gap up here. But we can, you know, we can take, we can use this C trader. We can actually take, uh, we can take partial positions and stuff like that. Take profit one. And I can take off like, Two thirds of this, or half of that, or seventy-five percent of it, right? Um, I can do that. Hey Tim, woo! Nice to see you in the room, brother. How have you been? Hey, mate. It's been a long time since I've been on online, and I'm starting to. Oh my God! It's God! <laughs> I'm so excited, you guys! You hear? You hear? Well, you're here. Watch me limit out, baby. Here we come. Here it comes. In five, four, three, two, one. Do we get lift off? Once we clear, this is a. There's another little zone right here. We're in a we're in the stick sandwich demand zone, and I might just take some of it off. No. Yeah. Been and running nice. Tim is one one of my one of those, well, you were you were awesome. Uh, I know you've had some, some some things you've had to take care of and stuff like that, but it was so good to uh, see your progress. You just okay, but uh, there is a little stick sandwich here projecting resistance. But see these red candles stacking down here. That if we break that, this thing it will air the this is like an air gap 
when you see vertical red candles like that, it's basically a gap, right? When they go straight down like that. Now, usually like price will meander, but when you have big drops like that, it's a gap. And then we look for the gap to be filled. So the gap is 1908 to 19156. And we came really close to our, our, our take profit. And here we come, here it comes. Here it comes, very close. It's licking it, it's sniffing it. It's like a cap at a new gate, sniffing the gate. Or a dog looking at a new bone. It's, sniff, it's sniffing, it's licking. Do I want to go there? Come on, pay me. <laughs> there we go. Come on. I might give an, here we go. Come on, come on, baby. Come to Papa. This little thick sandwich is kind of scary. I might just go ahead. You know what? I'm not, I'm going to take my money and tip and run. Okay, so there you go. So there you go. We, we took it. Green, green everywhere. Green, green everywhere. Okay. So we took position here on the break and the bounce. And we took um, this there to the, uh, the one spot one nine. Oh, look at that. And it's, yeah, wait a little bit. Okay, and now we broke. Uh, I don't know, we're probably gonna go in again. I'm just, I am just gonna scalp, see if we can scalp this this air gap, this space. And let's see. Now I'm gonna draw a trend line too. And if, you know, if this thing reverses, I mean, I'm only put a very tiny, you know, relatively small position compared to what I'm actually, I actually, <laughs> so if I get stopped out on that, I don't really care. I'm gonna bring, I am gonna bring the stop though, below the low of the candle, so. Oh, that, that stop is too big. Right. I'm on a five minute chart of the euro. I'm gonna bring that stop up to the uh, the base of that candle. That's gonna give me a, a, a five point six tip stop. So actually, either it's gonna so it's either gonna reverse and stop me out, or it's gonna break and keep going. Kind of a wick. This 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 zone here, right? And sometimes we can, so we'll see if we get a little continuation there. Tip and run. Why buy and hold? We can tip and run. No overnight exposure. Uh, you know, get out of this trade. I'm only going to switch it off and uh, go to bed. I got another account. It's on um, it's on MP4, and it's probably really gangster. But we'll see if we um, now see we're getting a haram. We have a bullish candle and it followed by a bearish candle, but we're hitting this trend line. So let's see if this trend line actually holds. Yeah, my stop is 5.6 pips. And if it hits that, that's gonna be like bearish engulfing and reversal. And I want to be out of this anyway, right? But you know, I'm just kind of being a little bit, a little greedy. I really wanted to see that this gap fill too. Um, and that's kind of one of my, one of my, uh, my, uh, my weaknesses. <laughs> I think it all, you know, you let me know in the chat box. You be a little greedy, you know. He's like, look, you know, you took it from, I took it from down, from way up high to down low pick the bottom, right? Now I went ahead and got back in and got long and then got back in again, right? So you think it, I could stop, but there is a kind of adrenaline kind of, you get that, um, you know, when does it turn from strategy to gambling, right? But that's why I put, I, I placed that stop in there. It's a hard stop. I'm not going to move it if it 
If it comes all the way through, then I'm going to um, I'm going to go ahead and and and, and kill it. So it's, it's going to kill itself, right? It's going to and it looks like it's it's coming for me. Like right? we're coming for your stop, Greg. I got Mr. Trendline here, and it's not holding. It's like a knife through butter, right? Just, let me let me stretch this out so we can like see it, right? Watch the drama unfold. <laughs> Will Greg get stopped out? Will his greed take his money back? Or will it break to new highs as he defies gravity? <laughs> hey, we have a lot of fun when we trade. It's not all dire and glum, especially when you know what's going to happen next. It's like having your own crystal ball. It's like being able to um, forecast price and Basically, it's like having tomorrow's newspaper today, being able to see these same patterns repeat themselves over and over again. And I mean, I don't know what's going on. I, you know, did check the news, but I knew that we had for for all you guys who are, you know, everyone here is like pipping around. You know, you know, you know what we look at, we look for. <laughs> don't type anything in the chat box. Don't put the secret sauce in there. But what we're doing is, uh, you know. Basically, you found wave C. This was like the ending diagonal of a big a drop move, right? So we know that after C comes one. Um, so if this is that, if this is that one, right? Then actually, this was our C, and this is one, and this may turn into a two. We're gonna get, we're gonna get tagged. Oh, look at that! You're kissing it, yeah. And if it, yeah, it's probably gonna, yeah, here it comes. Oh, I am tagged out, I'm out, I'm out, right? But, um, so so we are, we are out, but we make some pretty good pips. And uh, we'll probably pull back, that we can take our Fibonacci and uh, reset this whole thing, right? So we have a new low, we have an established low. Oh, I'm going to take the recycle, recycle and reuse this Fibonacci. I have an established high and I have an established low. And so now we look for price to tag one of these support areas and probably bounce back up to new highs over, you know, usually the direction we break out during London is the direction that price continues for the rest of the day, right? So we had this really surge breakout during London. So we might get a little pullback to our opening range breakout, and then we'll probably move higher, right? So it'll look like something like this. So in case you are up and it still, uh, you know, you still got some juice in your tank and you want to, uh, I'm, I'm fading fast. Look for one of these areas to be tested and then look for price to zoom up, right? You know, and then you can take a Fibonacci expansion and all that good stuff, right? So, so that would, uh, so we do this on a pretty regular basis. And um, I just want to take you back to, take you back somewhere, right? Sunny Beach, yay. No, I thought that was there. Okay. So, EliteFairiesUniversity.com. And um, if you, if you need to learn more about uh, trading, if you want to know about more of what we do and how we do it and who we are, it's all found on the website, leadcreatorsuniversity.com. There's a free master class. You can click that and you can sign up, watch the entire thing so you understand what's going on. And if you feel you're a good fit, click the button and, and sign up. You know, you guys had, uh, you were in Elite Traders University. What do you think, guys? <laughs> Give me a, you a shout out. <laughs> Secret sauce is all right, huh? It's pretty tasty. Good stuff, Maynard. Toasty wheat, crunchy malt, iron fortified. So um, if you want to learn, invest in your future, invest in your trading. It cost you not, it will cost you a lot not to be part, okay? So um, with, uh, with that being said, thank you so much for being part of this live broadcast. And I look forward to doing another one. If you like it, let me know in the chat box. And uh, uh, God bless all you guys. 
and we'll talk to you soon. Remember, why buy and hold when you can dip and run? Talk to you later. Hey, thank you. If you felt a spark here and want to see how these principles can be used in your own trading, go to www.elitetradersuniversity.com forward slash apply to book a free session with our team. We have helped hundreds of people remove the frustration and obstacles in trading to become consistent, highly profitable traders. These are proven principles that just work. Happy pipping!